Hello everyone, welcome back. And today we will talk about the anatomy of extensor pollicis brevis muscle. So in the previous tutorial we discussed this muscle which is the extensor pollicis longus muscle. And today we will talk about the extensor pollicis brevis muscle which is this short fusiform type of skeletal muscle and it is one of the deep muscles of the posterior compartment of fora. So this muscle has got its origin from the posterior surface of distal half of shaft of radius and the adjacent interosseous membrane of fora. And then just like its fellow muscle, the extensor pollicis longus, the muscle fibers of the extensor pollicis brevis muscle also form a muscle belly which travel down inferolaterally towards the wrist. And just superior to the wrist joint, this muscle belly forms a muscle tendon. And this muscle tendon crosses the wrist joint and travels down towards the thumb and inserts onto the dorsal aspect of base of proximal phalanx of thumb. Unlike its fellow muscle, the extensor pollicis longus, which inserts onto the distal phalanx of thumb. Now let's talk about the actions performed by this muscle. So just like the extensor pollicis longus, the extensor pollicis brevis muscle also extends the thumb. Now lastly, let's move on to the nerve supply of this muscle. So just like the other extensor or posterior muscles of forearm, the extensor pollicis brevis muscle has got its innervation from the deep branch of radial nerve, which is also called the posterior interosseous nerve of forearm. So this is the radial nerve, which gives off this branch called the deep branch of radial nerve which supplies almost all the posterior muscles of forearm. And if we talk about the nerve roots involved in supplying the extensor pollicis brevis muscle, so the anterior rami of 7th and 8th cervical spinal nerves give nerve fibers to the extensor pollicis brevis muscle. So that's all about the anatomy of extensor pollicis brevis muscle. If you have any confusion in what we studied today, you can ask me in the comment section. Thank you so much.